part of the Indigenous Australian subject. We went to Cape Cleveland with a local elder by the name of Uncle Rusty. And I introduced them to the bush. Instead of looking at the bush, we look through it and see everything for what it really is. They can see the real Australia. It's not a theory in a classroom. My classroom is the bush. And they can reach out and touch everything. And what I talk about, they can actually utilise it. It was really interesting. I've, I've never had an experience like that before. I feel like there's so much knowledge to be learned from the environment. I feel like back home, we don't have that many courses on it. We learn a little bit about the Aboriginal history in history classes in Norway, but it's different being here and experiencing the history from Aboriginal people telling us. I liked when he was telling us about the plants the leaves and what they could do. He used a leaf from a tree and mixed it with water and put it on my mosquito bites and they stopped itching. So it worked and it was really cool. I'm definitely taking in as much as I can from our, our bush tucker and bush medicine. And journeys of Uncle Rusty, I'm interested in looking for new medicines, particularly from plants and fungi which do grow in the area. Using something practically while out in the bush is one thing, but to take that into the lab then to be able to use it further with our Western mind is definitely a beautiful synergy. This afternoon we've come to Turtle Rock, which is up Howie's range, to look at the rock art there and for Uncle Rossi to tell more stories about Indigenous Australians in the local area. So this subject is core for the Bachelor of Arts for the Indigenous Studies major and minor, but it can be taken as an elective for any of the strands within the Bachelor of Arts and it can also be taken as an elective for any of the other degrees within James Cook University.